Salmite for the blind. Salmite Braille Video Tutorial Creating a Table of Contents The Table of Contents, abbreviated as TOC, is created by relying on the text formatted with heading styles. Creating a TOC in SMB can be done in both the print document and the braille document window. This video will explore its options and how to create a TOC. On the screen is a pre-formatted print document. At the beginning is the title style, followed by content with the following heading styles. A heading 1, a heading 2, a heading 3, and another heading 1 at the end. By default, the TOC is created and placed at the beginning of the document. To create a TOC, 1. Go to the Insert menu. 2. Open the Table of Contents submenu and select Generate TOC. Insert Page Break C. T Generate Talk. Talk Sample Document. SMD Print D. SM Docs. Sow My Braille. Table of Contents About Sow My For. Table of Contents. Link About Sow My For the Blind. SMCB Link 2. Link our mission link to Link some of our notable achievements link to Link Sao My Software link 3 The TOC has just been created and placed at the beginning of the document. The TOC can also be created in the Braille document window. We will explore the TOC options and recreate the TOC in the Braille document window. Go back to the Insert menu, open the Table of Contents submenu, and select Update TOC if you want to update the TOC after any changes in the document. Here, we will select Delete TOC to delete the previously created TOC. Insert page break seat generate generate talk update generate talk update talk delete talk talk sample document dot SMD print D SM dot sow my for the blind. Now press Ctrl plus T to convert to Braille. The document is ready to view. Edit. TOC Options 1. Open the Options dialog from the Tools menu. Score Info Options Preview General 2. Open the Styles section and select the TOC Settings page. Then, press Tab to navigate through the following options and explore. S. Styles Collapsed. Expanded. T. Text. T talk. Place TOC at. Choose the location to place the TOC in the document. Here, we will select Current Location instead of Top of Document. SMB will place the TOC at the cursor's position. Tab Control Styles Property Page Tab Control Talk Property Page Tab Leader Print Talk Grouping Place Talk at Combo Box Top of Document Collapsed Bottom of Document Current position. Show levels. Choose the heading style levels to list in the TOC. Here, it is set to 3, meaning all content with heading 1, heading 2, and heading 3 styles will be included in the TOC. Show levels edit multi line alt plus L selected 3. Show print page number. Choose to display page numbers for each TOC item. Please note, this option only applies to the print document. The Braille document will always display page numbers. Show print page number checkbox checked alt plus s. Print tab leader. Choose the tab symbol to separate the TOC item content and its page number. Please note, this option only applies to the print document. Combo box dots collapsed. Options below are only for Braille. TOC. First line indent. Specify the number of spaces indented from the left of the first line of the paragraph that is applied with the first level heading style. Here, it is set to zero, meaning the heading one in our example will not be indented on the first line. Braille talk grouping, first line indent edit multi-line selected zero. Child level indent. Specify the automatic left indent for child level headings. Here, it is set to two, meaning as compared to heading one, Heading 2 will be indented by 2 spaces, and Heading 3 will be indented by 4 spaces. Child level indent edit multi-line selected 2. Left indent. 
Specify the left indent for wrapped lines in a paragraph with the first level heading. Left indent edit multi-line selected zero. Right indent. Specify the right indent for all lines in a paragraph with the first level heading. Right indent edit multi-line selected zero. Centered text. The title content is centered and placed on a separate line at the beginning of the TOC. Centered text edit selected contents. Left column text. The header text for the TOC item's name column. Here, it is chapter, which we now change to section. Left column text edit selected chapter. S-T-C-T-I-O-N. Guide dot. Braille dot pattern to separate the column of the TOC item name and the page number. Guide dot edit selected five. Right column text. The header text for the page number column. Right column text edit selected page. Braille page number prefix. Braille symbol to be indicated before the Braille page number in the TOC. Leave blank if not needed. Braille page number prefix edit selected 6-12. Print page number prefix. Braille symbol to be indicated before the print page number in the TOC if the add print page number to TOC option is enabled. Leave blank if not needed. Print page number prefix edit selected 6-1234. Add print page number to TOC. Select this option to add the print page number along with the braille page number in the TOC. Add print page number to talk checkbox checked. Click OK to save the changes. Talk sample document dot SMB braille style my braille edit. Now, we will create a TOC placed right below the document title in this Braille document by moving the cursor to the desired location, going to the Insert menu, opening the Table of Contents submenu, and selecting Generate TOC. Title Blank Heading 1 Insert Page Break CTRL to Generate Talk Talk sample document dot SMB braille style my braille edit. The TOC has been inserted at the location of the cursor. Press F8 to view the braille document in BRF format. BRF 100% edit. Page 1. Blank, 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 page 2. Blank, 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 blank. For any questions, please email us at support at Thanks for watching.